the uh, the attendance is something that has definitely been a topic of conversation mm-hmm. for Duck fans. Just because UCLA, like you said, has not seen a ton of attendance this year, and Austin is a formidable place to play. Is that something that you think UCLA should be worried about this weekend, playing in such a hostile environment? I don't think the hostile environment so much as as the well. I mean, look, the it's it's loud, unlike most other places. Um, that aren't a hundred thousand people, <laughs> you know. I think the the noise there is deceiving because it's not a particularly large stadium, um, and so. But the crowd is right on top of you, and so it feels really loud. Um, I, I and clearly, no one at UCLA right now has had a great deal of success in an environment like that. Last year at Utah. They got run over, you know, pretty handily. And Utah's a tough place to play on a Saturday night in November, you know. And I was there, and it was it was extremely loud. Um, so there isn't a lot of experience with success in that kind of environment. The if you're Chip Kelly and you're piping in tons of crowd noise at practice, you know, this week like he is. Um, you know, you're looking at it and saying, look, we've got a veteran team. They've played in big games. They've played in hostile environments. But like I said earlier, yeah, but not like this. Not like this game. Not with this much at stake and not in this tough of a place to play. So I, I, I think I think that you look to see what happens early on. You know, false start penalties or, you know, um, some some mental errors in the, the – that take the form of penalties in the first five minutes of the game. If UCLA can stay away from that uh, early on, then mentally and emotionally, they're they're where they need to be. Chip is also a person who knows as well as anyone how crazy Austin Stadium could get because he was yeah. there, you know, during the heyday. So it's, yeah. it's yeah. an interesting he helped, dynamic. Yeah, he helped create the heyday. And, mm-hmm. um, you know, he looks at it as, you know, I've been, been out there already. It's just another game. It's just, you know, because that's just who and what Chip is. You know, he's, yep. no, he's never going to lead on that there's anything different about anything in any particular game. So I think if UCLA can get through the first five minutes without any, you know, even the minor errors, the minor penalties, I think it's a sign that they're dialed in the way they need to be.